All right, here we have the hovercraft. This is the test on a few different surfaces. So here it is on uh, just a smooth kitchen floor-like surface. I'm going to go ahead and angle the camera over there so you can see it go. And you can see it glides pretty easily. Next, we're going to try carpet. Okay, here it is on the carpet. See, it still slides a little bit, but that air can escape pretty easily. And I think that's probably partly due to just the faulty design of the skirt that we did since we built it so quickly. Um, if you watch the other video, that entire video was me building it, and it was only about 20 minutes long, so this is a little hovercraft we built in about 20 minutes. Um, next, we're going to try pavement, I guess. Okay, so here we have it just on the garage floor, and it actually slides really easily on here. And I'm going to slide it out there onto the pavement. As you can see, it's a lovely rainy day, but at least it's, it's warm here, unseasonably warm. But I'm going to go ahead and slide it out onto the pavement. Here we go. And it stopped pretty much instantly on that pavement. But uh, while we're out here, I see a little puddle here. Let's go ahead and see if it'll work on water. Um... No, not really. It doesn't really work on water either. Well, that's interesting. I guess I'll probably end up making another one at some point, and I'll probably try and build it a little better and show you guys just a few steps of the process instead of the whole thing. But yeah, if you want to see how I built this, uh, you can go and you can check out the other video. It's really easy to do and really cheap and actually free if you have the stuff lying around your house. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe.